Hi guys, hope you are enjoying your summer so far. So in ACE this week, you're going to be learning about fireflies, which are also called lightning bugs or glowworms. Um, and one activity it, you're gonna make is this one. Uh, yours is actually gonna be non-colored. These are some me and Ms. Sykes did. Uh, and you're gonna light it up using a circuit. And of course it's not gonna work. And whoops, maybe this. So we have several different ones that we've done, and we'll teach you how to do that. Um, some interesting facts about lightning bugs or fireflies is they're actually part of the beetle family. Um, the females actually don't fly. Uh, they do not have wings, so the ones you see flying around are actually males. And um, they are nocturnal, which you know means only comes out at night. Um, the best time to see fireflies is in the summer, early evening in, in a meadow or a field. Uh, fireflies live in the ground inside rotten wood or trash. Um, some of them will eat, the larvae will eat worms or snails. They only have, they have a short lifespan, usually one to three weeks. They do not bite or attack or carry diseases, so it's okay to catch them if you can. Uh, also, the the reason they glow is their bodies have a fluid called luciferin in the abdomen, and that's what causes them to glow. So, you will get in your kit, you will get a paper, like I said, looks like this. We have a ruler. It's a paper ruler, but keep it because you may need it for other activities. We have some copper tape. A battery and you're actually going to get two um, little light bulbs there'll be two of them in there so you can choose which one you want to use um, now to build this your first instruction says to fold the card in half along a dotted line we've already done that for you so you can skip number one and then it says uh, with the pen poke holes through the two black dots. We've actually already done that for you also, so you can skip that and go to number three. So number three says you're gonna insert your light into the holes. I don't know what I did with my light, so I'm gonna get another one. Okay, and if you notice on your light, there are two different links. Okay, so that's important, very important. Make sure you're aware of that. Um, the positive one is a little bit longer. So this side would be positive, this side is negative. You're gonna take on the front of the card and the longer one you're gonna put in the left. So make sure you're facing it, no, you're left. So you're gonna put the longer one in the left side, the shorter one in the right. Okay, you're gonna push it all the way through. Okay, so your front's gonna look like that. Then on the back, you're going to fold. You may have to hold your light. Fold your two little wires down. Okay, one towards the positive side, one towards the negative side. And then you're going to start taping it. So you're gonna take your copper tape and you're going to um, measure and tape it down it doesn't matter where you start at just start at one of the ends so I'm gonna start here this long end you're gonna measure 10 centimeters so take your wire measure 10 centimeters this is a centimeter ruler so there's just one side then you can either tear it it tears real easily or you can use scissors Okay, or you can actually just use the whole piece and fold it. That'd be a little harder. Okay. Now, it's very important that you uh, make sure as you're putting this on that your sides touch. Okay, and it can extend a little bit. We made one here. If you see this one, we didn't make it all the do it very good and if you notice our light doesn't work okay on these other ones you can see how we have overlapped them 
and therefore our light is working. So make sure you have a closed circuit. Our top here, we're gonna measure six centimeters, and again, you can cut it or tear it. Just peel off the sticky part on the, or the white part on the back. Maybe. Okay, now, when we put it here, we're gonna cover up this wire of the light and we're make sure you overlap it on the corner. So we're gonna cover up overlap on the corner, cover up the wire, make sure you seal that in there, make a good connection. So smooth that out real good. Okay. And then we need to measure for this side here. We need eight centimeters. Now here, the connection for these two is going to be the light bulb. So you don't have to, do not overlap your copper on the light bulb side. So I'm just gonna put it on this wire here, extend it, and again, make sure that that's connected good. Okay, and then you should have your one little piece left for the bottom, but it would be five centimeters if you start that side. Overlap it. Make sure you cover good because this is where your battery is going to go. So we have a gap here, but our battery is going to fill in that gap there. So we're just going to bend the corner of our paper. Okay, and now we're going to tape the battery down. It says on your um, paper to use a binder clip. If you have a binder clip, you can, but if not, you could just tape it or you can even just hold it. Um, we did a couple of different ways. Here we taped, make sure you leave a space. Don't tape your battery solid, make sure you leave a space for it. Um, one Miss Sykes tried was just folding it and taping on the back, not the battery, and you can tell that works as well. Okay, so you're gonna open your battery here. Oh, also one thing, um, to light up the light bulb, it has to be a certain way. So see, there, so the longer end goes on positive, shorter end negative. So if for some reason you put your battery down and it doesn't work, it may just be you have it switched the wrong way. So just flip your battery over. You're gonna put the negative side down, which is this, right? The flat side. Which is the uh, side with nothing on it. The, the other side has a plus on it. So that goes facing up. And then you can just hold it together and we light up. And there is your lightning bug. Your lights in your, we put a couple of different, you may have the same color, you may have different colors. We put green, we try to do green, blue, and yellow. So see which one you get. I'll show you putting a piece of tape here. You can hold it. Again, if you don't have tape, that's fine. You can just hold it with your finger, okay? And then if your battery moves, then it'll go off. Um, if for some reason you don't have a connection like this one, then you may have to take, if you, if you did it like this, you're gonna have this, uh, We in each packet we put 30 centimeters of wire. So you have plenty to overlap. So if you did one like this, you should have extra paper. I don't know if we can get this one to work or not. We can try. You might because right here, this would be an open circuit because your path is not connected. So we can put a little more there. Let's try and see, oh there's my battery. Let's see if this works. Also notice down here, we don't have a whole lot touching the battery, so it still may Flip not work. Flip your battery. Oh. See, I do the battery the wrong way. So it still didn't work. Um, it's not sealed real good here up here, so let me try putting a little bit more copper tape up at the top. Maybe. To seal that wire in better. Not, not very much 
Let's see if that will work. So the next thing I'm going to try is maybe extending a little bit down here. I think I had one more little piece of tape here, so I'm not right here. Let's see if I need to extend that on the battery. Maybe. No, I might have put a little bit more there too. Well. Okay. Have a little more connection there for the battery. And we got it. So if yours doesn't work the first time, flip your battery. Make sure you have your battery the right way. And if it still doesn't work, then go to the back and check all of your, your path. path. Okay, because if you have a broken spot, it doesn't allow the electricity to run all the way around your circuit. So, make, so check those things. All right. Hope you enjoy it. Make sure you send pictures to Miss Rutherford. Um, her number is in, I believe it's going to be in the packet or email them. And we can't wait to see your lightning bugs. Thank you.